Magandang araw sa ating lahat mga kaboksing at magandang gabi din sa lahat ng ating mga tagapanood at mga tagasubaybay na kung saan gabi ang kinaroroonan yung lugar o bansa. Muli nating panuorin ang katatapos lang na laban ni Gerald Paklar sa Bansang Afrika laban kay Lendel ng Siki. Ang laban na to ay naganap kaninang madaling araw lang mga kaboksing. Ang sagupaang Paklar versus ng Siki ay 10 round ng title bout sa bantamweight division. Bago ang kanilang laban, ang ating kababayan na si Paklar ay may professional boxing record na mayroong labing pitong panalo, may pitong talo, may apat na draw at mayroong sampung panalo by way of knockout. Samantalang pambato ng South Africa na si Lendel ng Siki ay may professional boxing record na mayroong labing tatlong panalo, may isang talo, may isang draw at mayroong anim na panalo by way of knockout. Okay mga kaboksing, panoorin natin ang kanilang naging laban. African champion and the former WBO global champion and the current APU and IPO intercontinental champion from Wittlesey, but now hangs in Danzane. Landile Mentown Mekel This bounce ladies and gentlemen is sanctioned and approved by Boxing South Africa Boxers This is round number one It's scheduled for ten Ah Petra comes out swinging wildly. Yeah. Oh, oh, big oh. punch in. Left hook. Wow. From the south to the border. But Mackie says, bring her on. You haven't landed. Oh, big left hook from Petra. Good jab. From the South African. The a tall guy for a bantamweight. That's punching down, Brian. A little bit of a challenge. Yeah, it's not always easier to fight a shorter guy. It's not an advantage to be taller, actually, in boxing. It could be a disadvantage. Oh, but he's throwing good punches now, as Nick He's a power puncher for a tall bantamweight. He has to keep his guards up. Protect himself against those wide swings from Hitler. We know he's been knocked out before. It's Landile Naki. So yeah, he's got to keep the hands up. Gerald Packler. The Predators come to win. Oh, but Packler gives us so many opportunities to knock him out. When he swings widely, he drops his guards. He does, but mind him. What I do like what Packler's doing is come to fight. Right up a cut, left hook from Packler. Oh, what a nice body punch is unbelievable from Andini Naki. They put everything in the body shot. It's the body like a heavyweight, Ronnie. Like he's a heavyweight. He's got to set the time. If he times it because he's too wild, uh, Petler. Oh, lovely chair. Wow. Solid left chair. Look at Wow, great punches. Right up a cut left hook from the South African Landini. Wow, swinging right hand, up a cut lands, left up a cut, right hand from Tekla in the Philippines. I speak about a Sunday punch, one may just land. Well, Tekla went the distance with South Africa's younger Kwebu. Will he go the distance with Nandini Neki? Of course, younger. Okay, we'll fight Sakara Manajika on the 23rd. Last 10 seconds of the third round. Good fight so far. Action packed. The crowd are loving it. Oh, definitely a slip, I would say. Nice opening round from these two fighters. Gerald Packler and Mandili Neki. Oh, if you want to look at 
your happiness that's a big picture beautiful picture everybody smiling shining their teeth and they're just happy lovely crowd always yeah. We know who they support him. Mark Ineki. Mile. Lovely to watch. Loving the boxing. And we're going to our second round of this international bantamweight fight. Scheduled for 10 rounds. Mondili Mandanaki against Gerald the Predator Pakla from the Philippines. Pakla's come to fight. He's getting his head jabbed off though. So nice to see a tall man that uses his reach and his advantage. Oh! Right hand from Pekla. He's bombing the right hand. Oh, big right hand up the top from Pekla. He's left to Keki says, bring it on as he, he whacks the body. Jones and Cole stands clever and Pekla. He's got to try an uppercut, Turkey. He's throwing too many straight punches. He falls forward, Pekla. He can pick, it up, pick him up with an uppercut. And Geki needs to whoop his uppercuts in. But he's getting hit with open right. And Geki, as he comes back in the left to... We have a war on our hands here. Well, you said it, Brian. Pekla has come to fight. He's not boxing. He's fighting. Well, you know, he went the distance with Younger, who's number 12 in the world. So... Not a slouch. Complaining about a punch down the head. We're only in round number two. We scheduled for ten. I love it. This is, how, this is how a fight must be. You don't have to wait for the, the ground to start fighting. Great combinations now for the South African left to the law. Oh, that's a great try down the middle from Mondele. Keep your guts up, Kirke, and walk with the chair. I was just going to say the same thing for Mani. Oh, brilliant combination for Kirke, but he's been knocked out before. Keep the hands up. Gerald Pekla has come to fight. What a fight. Oh. Try and check him downstairs. Go to the red master. Throw some body punches, Kirke. Now the problem with Neki is he drops his hand. After a combination, he drops his hand. Wow. Good punches from Pekla. And great punches from Neki. The swings from Pekla are dangerous, man. He has to move side to side, keep the guards up, protect himself at all times. I bet Martin like came all the way from the Philippines. Yeah, he's got a problem. He's got to keep his hand up. Yo, good fight. That's only two rounds. Oh, I don't know why she's crying because oh, Nikki has a loss. It's looking good actually. Well, oh, both fighters loading up. It's a bit scary when Neki leaves his left hand after a combination. And he's a really a good puncher, an accurate puncher as Neki. But that defense bothers me.
Who says they're not passionate in East London about their fight game? They love it. They even cry at the boxing. Oh. Round number three. It's been lively. It's been exciting. We are scheduled for ten in this bantamweight international non-title fight. So only one way is Patra prepared to win here today. Not trying to collect any points. He wants a knockout. Now, but that's the right thing to do for him. Come on, he's in another country. Not that he's going to get a bad decision, if it's fair, but in another country, go for broke. Obviously, keep your hands up at all times. That's what a fighter's got to do, a good fighter. But he's come to fight Pekla, I like it. He's giving Geki a run for his money, Neki at least. Good right hand from Pekla. Oh, big right hand from Pekla. Neki says, bring it on. Yo, these guys are bombing each other. Pekla understands the business of the body punches and the uppercuts. He's tough. Little Pekla is tough. He's cut now. Oh, right hand from Neki. Neki's seen the blood. He's going for gold. Then he's got to get back to the jab. Long jab. And pick him up with the uppercut. But Pekla is tough. Oh, brilliant uppercut from Neki. I was just about to say, Neki is such a power puncher. Doesn't like it, Pekla. It's all over. It's all over. He's won. That really man down Neki. He's won by knockout. Wow, the crowd are on their feet. They love it. What a spectacular win. Yeah, yeah. Why not that? I had just said, Pekla is tough. Mommy J just cares. <laughs> yeah, but Pekla is tough. Just, I mean, look at his eyes. He's got a bloody eye now. If the camera goes on him, there we see now. He got, he got smashed by Nandili man down Neki. He's only had one loss, and that was when he got knocked out. Other than that, he's had a draw and all wins. Let's see if we can see that uppercut. There's the left hook. There's a straight right, left uppercut. Kind of, I think he caught him in his eye. There's the left hook. Straight right down the middle. Left upper, it's a left uppercut. Uh, you know, there's so much power generated from Neki. She caught him on that cut eye. Left uppercut. Yeah, that's it. Left uppercut. In his right. Ladies and gentlemen, the official time for the stoppage is 1 minute 47 seconds in round number 3. And the winner by no count is Landile Mentown KK. So ayun mga kaboxing, talo po via round 3 knockout ang ating pambato na si Gerald Paclara. So sa laban na to ay tila nag-aim lang po si Paklar na man-knockout niya ang kanyang kalaban at hindi niya sinagang manalo round by round. Ang problema ay maganda ang naging depensa at opensa ng Afrikano na sinang Siki. Napakaganda po ng kanyang galawan kaya nahirapan ang Pinoy na si Paklar na patamaan nito ng kanyang malalakas na mga hooks. Sa ganda ng depensa ng Afrikano ay hindi rin nakuha ni Paklar ang tamang distansya ng kalaban kaya sa hangin tumatama ang kanyang mga suntok. At sa round 3 nga ay bumagsak na nga po itong ating pambato na si Paklar matapos tamaan ng left uppercut sa noo at hindi na nitong nagawang makabangon. At natalo nga ito via knockout sa round 3. So congrats kay Lindel ng Siki at bounce back naman kay Gerald. Paklar. Para sa mga latest boxing updates, mag-subscribe lang po kayo sa ating YouTube channel. Maraming salamat po mga kaboksing.